good morning. Um, today is July 9th. We're back in Gunnison for another family weekend. Uh, headed to Blue Mesa right now to do a little fishing. We've been hearing the salmon's doing pretty well. Um, they're catching some of those four or five year old salmon. We're headed over there to see if we can try to catch some of those. Um, my dad's friend Greg is here today. So we're gonna be fishing with him and Julie, of course. Um, so we're gonna head out right now. We just got the boat loaded up and we're gonna head out. set these up usually is I'll usually run some sort of dodger um, just on basic line here we think we have 15 pound test line here um, so I'll hook this dodger straight to the 15 pound test line and then just hook a straight any kind of lure really that um, spins or any good trolling lure I mean I try them all I haven't had problems with too many I haven't found one that really doesn't work um, it just depends on how the day is so I switch them on and off and depending on how it goes um, pinks, greens, oranges, like yellows, anything really will work pretty good. Um, but that's pretty much how I set them up, is just a straight dodger and then, and then the lure. So that's, that's basically my setup, no secret. Head in now. Oh, the motor died. No battery. Still pulling the lines. So we just got back from the reservoir. Um, we caught like five or six fish today. So it was kind of like really slow actually. So that was kind of disappointing. They were all salmon. Um, we really didn't get into the four-year-old salmon. Um, that four-year-old range is really like where you want those salmon. They're nice, more mature fish. But most of the ones we caught were really small. We caught two that were worth keeping. Greg wanted to keep them. Uh, he enjoys eating them. He has a neighbor who cans them. So that's really nice. I think we're going to head to Taylor Reservoir tomorrow instead of Blue Mesa. Um, Taylor just produced a lot more better results for us and uh, just a lot better scenery as well. Um, so that's where we're up to. I gotta go to the store and get some more lures today and then I think we're gonna go try and find some lunch. So that's what we're up to. All right, so we just finished lunch over at Cafe Silvestri. Um, it's a Mexican food restaurant here in Gunnison. Um, I'd probably give it an eight and a half. Julie? 10. Julie gives it 10. Um, so if you're ever in Gunnison, go check out Cafe Silvestri. Um, it's really good. 
um, authentic Mexican food. Um, so now we're headed over to Pitkin to go check out the area over there. I've uh, been over by Pitkin, but I've never been to the actual town of Pitkin, so we're gonna go check that out a little bit and kind of just see what's going on over there. And then I think tonight we're coming back and we're gonna grill some steaks and just kind of hang out. So we just got back from picking. Um, I tried to go fish the river real quick um, before dinner, but uh, everywhere I went was just super crowded with the people. So I didn't want to fish around a bunch of people. So uh, I think I'm going to get a quick run in um, just because I've kind of felt like crap all day from not exercising today. So I need to get a run in. I'm going to go do a couple, couple miles, but first I got to change. Much better. Alright, pretty solid run. That was about a two mile run at like an 8.13 pace. I'm not sure if you can see that. But definitely getting faster. Um, I've been trying to run a little bit more. I'm um, getting ready for elk season. Uh, me and a buddy and probably my brother are going to be packing into um, the high country this year and camping up there. So we're going to have to carry a lot of weight with us. Um, so I'm really just trying to get ready for that. Um, being up here in Gunnison it's a little higher elevation than home. Um, so it's definitely better for better training for my lungs. Um, getting them used to this elevation, so it's not as much of a shock when we do go hunting. Um, we're about we're about to eat some dinner now, um, and then we're going to head out fishing tomorrow morning. Uh, we're going to hit Taylor Reservoir and hopefully catch a lot more fish than we did today. Um, I want to thank everyone for for watching these vlogs. I really do enjoy making them, and I hope you enjoy watching them. Uh, like I said, I'm always trying to bring you guys bigger and better stuff. So if you have any feedback, please let me know how I can improve. Um, that way I can just keep getting better each and every single time. Um, that's it for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. I will be okay.